A portion of the city of Bemidji is recovering today after a tornado touched down on the morning of the 4th of July. Reporter Cheryl Moore has the latest on the damage. I was scared and stuff. I thought <clears throat> something happened to my husband Mike and stuff. And when, when I came home, I just got out of the car and started crying. Latromi County Emergency Management has now confirmed it was an EF1 tornado with winds from 90 to 100 miles per hour that hit yesterday morning at around 6.30. The tornado was exactly 20 yards wide. Tornado sirens did not go off yesterday because the high winds did not meet the criteria for activation. Obviously right here in the uh, uh, heart of Bemidji, uh, it's kind of rare to get this concentrated uh, damage. Some say they were just starting their normal routine when the tornado hit. I was in the, in the kitchen in the house and it, uh, about uh, probably about 6.30, it sounded like a freight train heading through my house. I, I didn't know whether to win, run, duck, or hide. Officials at St. Bartholomew's Church, which sits on the corner where the tornado hit, says they were alerted about the storm through social media. Luckily, there was no major structural damage to the church, only some roof damage and a broken window. I was up and on Facebook with people and watching the radar and... It's just kind of I saw it happen in live time that people were posting pictures and I'm like, that's our neighborhood, that's St. Bart's. And so as the church administrator, I started gathering photos and alerting people. From uprooted trees to debris left all over the roads, the mess the tornado left will take a little while to clean up. Although luckily, even a day later, we're still not hearing any reports of injuries. If it wasn't for friends, I don't think I would have survived this one because I was pretty devastated yesterday morning. Today, neighbors were helping neighbors with cleanup duty. Many are also thanking the first responders for their help in the aftermath. The city was super fast on the, on their part of the cleanup with the, the 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 street the street trees. I still have bad dreams about it and stuff, and I feel sorry for the other people that have to clean up their yard and stuff. Reporting in Bemidji, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. And again, fortunately, no injuries reported as a result of that tornado. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.